Wildfires in Greece raged overnight Friday as authorities struggled to contain 154 blazes across the country. The biggest fronts are still burning in the north of Athens, on the island of Evia and in areas of the Peloponnese. Firefighters with waterbombing aircraft are battling to contain the flames with high winds causing them to spread further. A 38-year-old man was killed on Friday by a falling electricity pylon in a suburb north of Athens. In the same area, police have been going door to door, urging people to evacuate their homes. The fires have already torn through thousands of acres of land, burning houses, destroying businesses and killing animals. Volunteers with an animal rescue organisation in the capital have been trying to rescue abandoned horses and dogs. This lady, who did not wish to be named, told Reuters eight dogs were locked inside the centre. While this man says they found many dead animals and are trying to get five horses to safety. Meanwhile, on the island of Evia, hundreds of people had to be evacuated from beaches as far as burned through forest land all the way to the shore. Greece, like much of the rest of Europe, has been grappling with extreme weather this summer. In neighbouring Turkey, Authorities are battling the country's worst ever wildfires. Flames have swept through its southwest and coastal regions, forcing tens of thousands of people to flee their homes. In Italy, hot winds fanned flames on the island of Sicily this week, 